Good morning. So, I'm making a video just to kind of uh, say why I'm doing this. Uh, man, I just couldn't take it anymore. I was so uh, sick and tired of being sick and tired. Uh, man, about uh, th th about two years ago, three years ago, I lost 120 pounds. I was about 300 pounds and got all the way down to 180. Uh, exercising and being on a plant-based diet. Um for a lot of that time and uh felt great uh jogged seven miles april two years ago that's so that would have been 2017 and then jogged seven miles straight the next morning i had a car accident so that was the first thing then my mom died and then i was just off the chain from there those are kind of excuses to be honest because i didn't have to my mom sure wouldn't have wanted me to gain all this weight back, that's for sure. Um, but, you know, sometimes you think you can handle things and they're a lot harder to handle than you think. I started making these videos as a way to keep myself accountable. You know, uh, like a lot of people, I have, I have ego, I have pride, and I'm thinking uh, if I make videos, and I, I, I also, we also have a Facebook group. Uh, we need to start a healthy revolution. And I, I put these videos on there, too. If you'd like to join that Facebook group, send me a message or whatever you guys do here on the Internet. I know you can. I know we can uh, hook up. Uh, there's a bunch of people doing the same thing. Not, and they're doing all kinds of different stuff. Weight Watchers, Keto Diet, uh, you know, um, uh, everything you can think of. Uh, just trying to get healthy, whatever it takes. Uh, I'm not just trying to lose weight, though. I want to be healthy, too. I had... I had a heart scare. When I had the car accident, they took a they took an X-ray in my back and they found a plaque on my heart in the widowmaker position. And uh, if you watch the Forks Over Knives video, uh, it's on Netflix. You'll see that the best thing you can do for your heart is uh, be on a plant-based diet. And it's not easy. And I'm not a hundred percent, but I'm right now 11 days in. I'm real close. Um, before I started this, I was starting to be embarrassed to be in a picture. I was starting to be embarrassed for people who see me skinny, uh, see me fat. Um, uh, I was, I was, uh, uh, isolating, uh, eating, gorging, eating in private, uh, all kinds of crazy stuff, just crazy and t insane stuff. Just going to bed sick every single night, and uh, I just had enough. I had enough. Uh, there's not one thing that made me want to change. It just got so bad that I, I felt I had to, uh, you know. And you know, uh, one thing that I found recently was these videos on YouTube. You know, uh, I'm a big sports fan, and I was found the Blues playoffs. And one thing that I I noticed there's a bunch of people who talk about the talk about hockey and other sports on YouTube, and they're just regular people, and uh, you know, and uh, it's kind of cool. So I decided to try this. I really haven't promoted this this at all or anything like that. It's really not about that so much. It's just about uh, if I put myself way way out there. You know, I'm my pride and ego may not let me go off the rails. One thing that I've done in the past is really slow down on social media after I've lost all the weight. Because uh, I've used Facebook before a lot. Uh, tracking, even putting my calories, how many calories I ate out there, how much I was walking. And that's how the Facebook group started. And then, uh, but then, you know, fell off the rails and... And when you lose all the weight, what, what do you do? You know, and, and I think it's real important to keep going. Uh, well, I got a long time before I do that. Uh, I've been doing it uh, 11 days. I've already lost 10 pounds. And and I know here's 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 what's happened a bunch of times. Because I try every week. I don't know if you guys, any of you guys can relate to this. I start every Monday. And I just see how far I can go. And this time I've gone a lot farther than you else. But what happens is I, I have early success. Like I lost 10 pounds and people who do this all the time will tell you, once you 
break a little barrier, a little goal, like your first goal, maybe 10 pounds. I know mine was. Then you're going to gain a couple pounds back. And it's, it's nothing you did wrong. It's, it's, just, it's just the way the body works. And you, you know, you're going to hit plateaus in the middle. I, I've ran and walked 30 miles in a week and didn't lose an ounce. And you just can't let that bother you. You got you to gotta concentrate on you know, that you walk 30 miles in a week. Now, I'm not doing that right now. I tried to walk a little bit today and, and work just wouldn't let me. Um, but I'm going to try again. I, I also do some other stuff, fish and stuff like that. Uh, which might sound weird since I'm on a plant-based diet, but it's just something I love to do. Uh, and, and 99% of the time, I throw the fish back. I'm catch and release guy. Um, but, you know, uh, I just wanted to make a video on why I'm doing this. I was sick and tired of being fat. And uh, I got too much going on. I'm raising my three grandchildren. Um, and I want to be able to do stuff with them. For instance, we've got six flag season passes. Uh, two years ago, I could have rode all the rides with them and everything. Today, I couldn't ride maybe one or two. Um, and I'm going to try it. I'm going to take them this weekend. It's either going to be Saturday or Sunday. I'm going to take them. And, uh, you know, I'm just going to be able to walk around with them. And if, two years ago, I would have been able to go on just about everything. I'm getting too old to do the roller coasters and stuff. But anything else I probably could have done. And today I can't. And I'm going to stop that. I'm going to stop that. We're going on a cruise in February. Going to Jamaica. Going to Mex back to Mexico. And then the Grand Cayman. And I'm not going to be the fat guy on the cruise. I'm just not. I'm, I'm, I'm going to, you know, they, on the cruise, they got one of those bicycle things. You can go around the top. I'm going to be on that. Uh, and I'm going to feel comfortable on it. And I'm going to be comfortable in the swimming pool and comfortable in the, uh, in the jacuzzi and stuff. I'm not going to be self-conscious uh, about my weight. Uh, so it's going to take a lot of work. Uh, I'm definitely working on it. Uh, you know, uh, I, I've been under a thousand calories three times since Sunday. You might think, well, you're not eating enough. And there's no calories in, in vegetables. Uh, there's plenty of protein in vegetables. Uh, and I know all that. I've done all the research I could, more than most people would because I'm a nutcase. I'm either all in or all out, and I've been all in on this, and then I've been all out, and now I'm trying to get back all in and even go do one more thing that might help, and this is the one more thing, you know, and you just never know when it's when it's going to click, when it's going to succeed. I don't, still don't know if anybody's watching these videos or uh, has any interest in watching them, but uh, if you do, uh, you know, you're welcome to subscribe to the channel. You're welcome to leave me messages. Uh, we can encourage each other. Uh, I know there's about 67% of the United States population and throughout the world that are fat. So we're all in this together. Uh, I couldn't pick a more diverse group of people to uh, try to join a group with. Thank you.